Good morning. I hope you're doing great today. You know, we've all seen the video of panic buying, the long lines and the empty shelves at stores just about everywhere. These are frightening images to anyone, but imagine if you're an 85 year old who lives alone. You've been told that the coronavirus is especially dangerous to you and can in fact be deadly. So the very last thing that you want to do is wander into that fray. Because of this, some stores are now creating special shopping hours only for the elderly and disabled. This is a great move. But you know what's even better? Is if we offer to shop for food, supplies, and medicine for those in our neighborhood or our building who are elderly, especially those who live alone. Yeah, the virus can be deadly, but so can social isolation. In fact, numerous studies have now proven that low social interaction as we age is more harmful to our health than smoking or alcoholism. And these days, it's harder than ever for the elderly to stay socially connected. We may have to revert to some old-fashioned ways of communication, but we still have a telephone. We can share photos and messages on social media. Video conferencing apps are now everywhere, and don't forget about the mail. A handwritten card can make a huge difference, especially to someone living alone. It can be read over and over, a constant reminder that there are people out there who care about you. So reach out and see what your older neighbors need. Pick up extra supplies and drop them off. Not only will you have a friend for life, you very well could save a life. Have a great day. See you tomorrow.